How to Build Trust in a Relationship, according to Sabrina Romanoff, Tsai a clinical psychologist and professor at Yeshiva University. Having trust in a relationship implies feeling secure and devoted to your spouse. To trust means to rely on another person because you feel safe with them and have confidence that they will not hurt or violate you. According to Romanoff, trust is the foundation of relationships because it allows you to be vulnerable and open up to the person without having to defend yourself defensively. Trust is important in relationships because it allows you to be more open and giving. Because you trust your partner, you are more inclined to forgive their flaws or irritating behaviors because you believe in them and know they have your back. When you trust your partner, you are more willing to overlook problems or commit to finding solutions to issues because you feel allied in areas that mean the most to you. Establishing trust creates a strong bond and foundation to build on. When you trust your spouse, you can be assured that they have your back and can be counted on for comfort, care, and support. Trust takes time to develop. And if your spouse frequently fails to keep promises or commitments, you will begin to have low expectations of them. Lack of trust can impact your relationship as it may create many problems. A lack of trust can also affect your mental health. Romanoff shares some strategies that can help you and your partner build trust in your relationships. There are a number of things that you can do to help promote trust in your relationship. An important step to build trust is to be honest and forthcoming when you violate expectations or hurt one another. What matters is that you can learn from each other and become closer after you've repaired whatever was damaged as a result of the mistake. Another step to build trust is to engage in open communication. Secrecy tends to erode trust. So when your partner is able to be transparent and allow space to explore topics that might trigger your mistrust, you can begin to feel more at ease and begin to let your guard down. The more you are able to get on the same page, the closer you will feel toward your partner. Open communication makes it easier for you to discuss concerns about the relationship. When you can have open communication, you will feel closer to your partner. If trust has been damaged in a relationship, there are things that you can do to help rebuild your trust, intimacy and connection. It may take time to rebuild trust, but continuing to work toward improving your relationship can help you eventually mend those damaged connections. Trust is an important pillar in relationships, and the lack of it can lead to negativity, conflict, insecurity, depression, and anxiety. If your relationship is weak in trust, it's critical that you work together to restore it so that you may relax your guard and be vulnerable with one another. You can seek help from a therapist or a couple's counselor if you're having trouble resolving your trust issues with your partner.